And this problem, I'll start by moving the 5y term to the left side. We'll get dy dx minus 5y is equal to 0. Now, negative 5 is our p of x term. So mu is going to be e to the integral of p of x dx. So mu is going to be e to the integral of negative 5 dx. So mu will be e to the negative 5x. Now we multiply mu to all the terms in the original equation. It'll be dy dx times e to the negative 5x minus 5e to the negative 5x y. And this will be equal to 0. Now this is just the product rule of mu times y and its derivative. Mu is e to the negative 5x. We just write y. Take its derivative. And this will be equal to whatever's on the right hand side, which just happens to be 0. We can now integrate both sides. On the left, the integration will cancel with the derivative. And on the right, we'll have 0 plus c, which will just be c. So it'll be e to the negative 5x. y will be equal to c. So y will be equal to c divided by e to the negative 5x. And that'll jump to the top and have a positive exponent. So y will be equal to c e to the 5x. And that is your final answer. If this video helped you, consider subscribing.